Hey guys, so that was just waiting to be done. We now got full Doom support on the Xiaomi Mi Band 8. And in some previous videos I did show a custom firmware running on them and the reverse engineering of everything like the display and touchscreen was really not that simple. And now we are back with fully running Doom. So by clicking on the top we can activate the menu, just like a start button. And then we can tap and go into the game, make it extra hard of course. And if I'm able to start it like so, you can then go forward, backward, left and right, and shoot, of course. And let's, uh, yeah, catch some enemies. And it's surprisingly hard to control while filming, but as you can see, we are nearly done. And maybe we are also done, yeah. Shit. Let's kill them first then. Damn it. We are just not hitting them. Okay, one last try. Maybe let's get some armor first. Uh, yeah, there we go, and that's a better direction, one down, and we can get him at it as well, damn it, okay, let's go, oh, it's another one, no, okay, yeah, that's enough. Uh, well, uh, this actually works fairly well. It was quite some work to get the Doom down to the 2 megabyte of flash. Um, while it has an external two, uh, 128 megabyte SPI flash, this cannot be used to have directly memory mapped data. And Doom is really not happy using this not directly mapped memory. So loading on demand is really like a pain. Uh, so I shrunk everything down. It's now running basically completely in these two megabytes of flash and one megabyte of RAM. And it's fairly smooth and really like high contrast, high, high colors. I like it. It's even wearable. Okay, bye-bye.